You will know early if Duke has flushed that Virginia win out of their system. Not easy to do. Very impressive by Virginia last night to bounce back and go on the road at North Carolina. A problem for Louisville early. That's Louisville starts those two small point guards. They were constantly being a mismatch in this game. Reddish. Well, Reese, they, they have the ability to switch one through five when they want to and keep the ball in front. Wara caught it and drains it. Jordan Wara. Taining, rarely we say that. Wara driving to the bucket. Can't get it to go. Second yeah. shot opportunity is there for Dwayne Sutton. What did you notice from Chris Mack at Louisville practice yesterday? Well, I think what I picked up and just would have known from Chris Mack is his incredible attention to detail. Williamson going for the steal, almost got it. Now Enoch, this is, this looks like it's committed like a shaky possession for Louisville, but Enoch failed him out with that left hand. Double team team and shot an unblockable shot with a left pump. How about Cunningham getting in there? And one more time, it's Reddish driving to the basket. A couple of strong drives last yes. couple of possessions. Nice cut, huh? Great look, great cut, good finish by Sutton. Majority of his field goal attempts from the outside with that one off the dribble. Barrett lines it up and knocks down the three. He was scorching the other night in Charlottesville to start, and RJ has an early triple. Now here's Trey Jones. Jones on the pull up. Look at Williamson flying in. He'll get another opportunity in the offensive rebound for the bucket. It was no good from Barrett. And I tell you, this has been a physical first nine minutes and change. Sutton with the bucket. He can Westbrook, and what I mean by that, get over the top of a ball screen as well as anyone I've seen this year. There he is. Perry pull up along the baseline. Louisville staying man-to-man -man on a miss. 1-3-1 one, one on a make. There's that there quick spin that you talked about in the pregame. Been mired in a three-point shooting slot. And Malik Williams blocks away the shot from Barrett. Four on the push. Quan finally gets one to go. Those five, though, are going to end up somewhere up there in those top eight seats that are for those one and two seeds. And that Virginia club, the most impressive one of the season so far last night. Pretty... Quiet on the offensive end. Got caught napping a bit on defense, which is not characteristic of one of the best defenders in the nation. And Zion goes underneath the basket. 40% is true. He has a very good release. Watch out. Steal by Wara. Williamson has 10. Zion's hit five of nine from the floor. Shooting right at 70% in ACC games. He does it again. As an offensive coach, not run a lot of sets. Teaching guys concepts, teach, teaching them spacing, trusting their natural instincts that he recruited. Enoch to have to shoot over, huh? Barrett getting in pain, having it knocked away. Good defense by Louisville. Enoch running and scoring. R.J. Barrett missed the reverse layup. Wara, oh, what a bounce pass to Perry. Perry with a finish. Wire. Jones is a terrific defender. Oh. As soon as that ball got driven, he's got to start going towards that timeline to get himself in the defensive play position. He doesn't do it. And, and his name is silent. Nothing else about him has been silent tonight. <laughs> nice screen. <laughs> Jersey's on the road. Louisville is quick to point out, hey, you know what? We're unbeaten in our true home whites, and we're choosing not to wear them. Woo. And R.J. Barrett knocks down a three. Ball screen, go to work. You saw him work on this today. He's sort of slipping it quickly. Wara puts it up. Perry yeah. got it! Shot with enough time to allow for an offensive rebound. You get it up around three or four. There's the first tip. There's the second, very similar to the play at Kentucky before us to decide the ball game. That will be a huge two points when this thing's all said and done. How do you get Trey Jones more involved in the offense? And he said, listen, we got to give Louisville a lot of credit. They knocked us off course, but we need multiple penetrations on every drive. Get yourself open and own your spot. So far, Louisville spot on in those three areas. Wow, what a horse. And one for number one. Mind if Duke is caught looking back rather than looking ahead a little bit and 
perhaps that is the case. Looking to the bottom of the bucket is Malik Williams. Well, you got to go to your two best guys, and we know that's, you know, Coach K has two or three to choose from, but certainly Zion and, and RJ, they, they, they've got to take control of this game. For him, has not been rough for Jordan Wara, who's pushing it into the front court. Quan 4-2. Has owned those areas in this game. Under 10 minutes to play now. Wara fires and scores again. Now let's look at it from the other side as Reddish finally gets one to go for the Blue Devils. 88, 89, 90 right in there. Yeah. Here is Reddish knocking down the three. Here's Max said he wanted quick game pressure on Duke and she might be on the other foot shortly, but just like that, Dwayne Sutton has a big answer in the lead. Goes back to 19. Chris Mack is going to build his program around guys like him. Zion gets between two, and he'll get the end one. This year for Williamson with 20 points and 10 rebounds. Jordan Goldwire forces a turnover tree. Jones lays it in, and just like that, yep. back to 14. Yep. Move the ball. Cunningham in a world of trouble, and has it taken away by Williamson. Barrett. Working on Perry, Euro me for the Canadian, and it's back to a 10-point game. Williamson has it, and Duke can get it back to single digits. He should have thought. He shot it with 15 on the shot clock. Williamson, and one! Put out of there. Louisville very fortunate they didn't turn it over, but then they did. Barrett jumped into the passing lane. R.J. working on Cunningham. R.J. Barrett, it's a five-point game with just over three and a half to play. 15. Holding the ball above your head and no pass fake is an automatic steal right now in this ball game. Reddish for three. We're down by two. And Chris Mack looks frustrated over on the side. Wara going to try to answer. He does. Jordan Wara. Headed toward two minutes to go. Reddish again fires for three. It won't go. Williamson can't get it. And Cunningham clears it away from Louisville. Trey wow. Jones steals and scores. Trey Jones has it. Duke with a three could tie. Reddish for the tie. Yes, sir. Are you kidding me? Goldwire got a hand on it and another turnover. Blue Devils have an opportunity to take the lead in this possession. Reddish again. Online, we're right in line. We was online just a little around the perimeter right now with eight to go on the shot clock. Now they're up against the clock again. Wara rims out. Duke has it again. Opportunity to give Duke the lead with 14.9 to go, and he does. As when doing the official review if i'm duke I, I i stay up with my pressure right now absolutely war popping out sets success. the screen cunningham over goal wire zion williamson pulls it away and the blue devils where they come back for the ages the biggest second half comeback in mike krzyzewski's career